Tapit King. Eh? How did we lose one? I think we should throw it in the back. Just to be safe. You ever wonder why there's a bank out here? Well, I think it's supposed to be like more of a vault, you know? Oh, that makes sense. Oh, you. You're free to go. <laughs> Not really. But you've got a package. Don't get your hopes up. We've already checked it for anything useful, haven't we, Dave? What? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> of course I checked it. I mean, if I didn't check it, I'd lose my job, and I don't lose my job. <laughs> See you around. Free to go. <laughs> hmm. Witness, please continue your testimony. Okay. I was riding alongside my partner in the armored van, but suddenly she spotted a bag on the side of the road. We got out and eventually decided to throw the bag in with the others. We didn't know there was someone hiding in there. OBJECTION! So, the defendant crawled into that bag in order to break into the bank. Is that correct? Is it not obvious? Is it really that obvious? I have proof that the defendant didn't hide himself in that bag. Well then. What are you waiting for? Present this evidence already. Take that! Is... is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. If the defendant really was hiding in this bag, then... How did he tie the knot from the outside of the bag? What? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. What are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stuffed in there. By this very witness! What? As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite the beating. While he was in the bag, he was unconscious! Th this is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag in with the others. But, but why would he do that? Why, to dispose of the body, of course. There are millions of bags of money in that bank, and the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot, and the witness thought everything was over. But it's come back to haunt him now. You guys can't, you can't, this, this, this can't be happening to me! Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I am now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, I declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit 
open. Yes, thank you. Yes. Whoa, uh, we got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that, we're preparing to engage over. And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a different job. I figured night garden is much less dangerous than driving a- Crap. No, Johnny! Officer down, repeat! Officer down! Sir, place your hands where I can see them. You Well, well. Look who finally decided to wake up. You've been quite elusive, but your skills make you worth the catch. You'll be perfect for the job. We've been having some issues with a group of thieves known as the Top Hat Clan. We know they're guilty, we just can't pin them down in crimes. You'll be going into the airship to bring them down. I don't need to remind you that we've got you on several charges. Attempting robbery, breaking yourself out of prison, even stealing the Tunisian diamond. We've got quite a lot of counts on you. Do this job right, and we'll drop all charges against you. Charlie here will be bringing you close to the airship. The rest is up to you. Find a way to bring him down, and you'll be a free man. Hey, uh, how do you want me to bring you in? Hey, I've been, I've been looking at the numbers here. What do you think? Ah, yes. Let me have a look. Go, go! I'll hold him off! Come on, then! Everyone listen up. We've got a security alert. Keep a look out for a guy in a big plastic ball. No, no, I'm serious. Whoa! Oh. Uh, hurry up now, activate the doors!
help, help. Defeat my right hand man. I surrender the airship to you. You think they're alright? Pretty big fall. I'm sure Henry had a plan. What is it? Henry! Hello, Henry. Welcome to the wall. Some of the most cunning and notorious criminals are kept here, and now we have the infamous Henry Stick. You're going to be here for a long time. Grigori, take him. You wait here until cell found. <laughs> Thanks. And I'm like, look at how much I care. I don't care. I ended up buffing up my guys and doing like 70 damage. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Oh yeah, last night, I kept- <laughs> Oh Hmm. If we can get you up there, you could get in and open this door. So, you say all inmates is out of cell? Yeah, some idiot. Hey, I just grabbed these. Maybe they'll come in handy. Are we waiting for someone or? I thought you press. We'll regroup with that. There is convict here. Get down on ground. <laughs> Back to your cell, inmate. Boing. Twack. <laughs> what, you think that will upset me? Oh, very much. Thanks, I guess. Now let's get out of here. Well, if it isn't Henry, there has not been an incident here in 50 years. And the day you show up, this happens. You are going to regret everything. <laughs>
preparations are nearly complete. Should be able to launch within the hour. So, this is the Top Hat Clan secret base. Sign me up. Whoa, what happened to that guy? Henry, you're back. I took charge in your stead. I hope you don't mind. <clears throat> uh, I'm Ellie. Uh, I'm new here. What are you guys up to? Well, uh, Henry, remember that orbital station idea we were talking about? We went ahead with that plan. We've got all of our assets in there already. Once the final preparations are complete, we'll be ready to launch into orbit. That should keep us far away from any governments trying to bring us down. We should be able hey, to- Hey, uh, Chief. Oh. <clears throat> hey, what did I tell you about calling me that? Henry is the Chief, remember? Oh, okay, yeah. We're under attack. You two, get to the rocket. Henry. One, two, three. The rocket is launching in five minutes. Do something. Just you wait till my friend gets here. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Bomb has been planted. Isn't this an EMP? Launching in one minute. We gotta hurry. You guys need a ride? Don't wanna get through, man. We've got company. Five, four, three, two, one. Wait! Henry's still down there! I'll keep the door open as long as I can! Come on, we gotta go. I got you, Henry! You know, I could drop you right now and nobody would know. But why would I do that? I saw you out there. Put yourself on the line to save the Top Hat Clan. You've truly earned my respect. I can't think of a better person to lead us. Thanks to Henry's efforts, we were able to establish our orbital station. Unfortunately, we lost quite a few members during the raid. With the station in orbit, we were able to raid any place on Earth with ease. Ellie was officially recruited into the Toppet Clan, and given the rank Right Hand Lady. Me and my right hand man went on to become top operators in the clan, performing several successful operations.